Hello everybody, welcome to another weekly vlog. This week is actually my birthday week, so I'm gonna be showing you, I don't know, we're not really doing a whole lot for my birthday, but I'm gonna show you the few things we're gonna do for my birthday. I actually wanna make my own cake, which I'll show you later on. And then I think I wanna get dressed up and like take some cute like Instagram photos, um, but that's really all I have planned for my birthday. I remember when I was little, my nanny, who's my grandma but I call her nanny she used to always get her own birthday cake and I was like why are you getting your own birthday cake why isn't someone else getting it for you and she was always like that's just what happens when you're a mom and a grandma and now that I'm a mom I get it and I'm probably gonna be making my own birthday cake because there's like a specific type of cake I want plus I just like to bake in general and so I'm gonna have fun doing it um but it's actually uh, I'm not I'm gonna do one of those like number cakes but I'm not gonna use cake I'm going to use sugar cookies because I feel like that is gonna be a lot easier so yeah I'm wearing Ryan Abe's average merch this is actually from like several years ago he has like new merch designs out but i haven't worn this in a while and his season of reality house just ended if you guys are new here i love ryan abe easily one of my like favorite internet personalities but yeah that's uh that's it for this little intro so i'll see you guys in a bit okay so as with every week i wanted to do like a little mini grocery haul where basically I just show the fun stuff that I got at the grocery store and not like the entire haul but I got two of these perfect bars um I always see Tara Henderson and Erin Williams um eating these because they're doing like some fit challenge on Instagram and so I got one in dark chocolate chip peanut butter and one in regular peanut butter so I thought I would try these they are like refrigerated so you have to keep them cold and then I saw that Walmart had these like cold brews that look like those Starbucks frappuccinos that you can get but these were a dollar less the Starbucks frappuccinos are $2.50 these are $1.50 so I picked up one of these just to try it out I love the Starbucks ones so we'll see how the great value one is and then I saw that they had this the everything bagel seasoning this is the Sam's Choice everyone talks about the Trader Joe's everything bagel seasoning but when I saw Walmart had this I was like I have to try that um, I actually put it on like a veggie sandwich today thinking like oh it's just like a plain sandwich with vegetables like this should make it taste better and it just made it taste like really salty honestly maybe I just put too much on I didn't really notice a huge difference in flavor other than it was super salty um, but I might try like a little on a salad or something later and then I saw this on TikTok. Some girl posted a video about it and it's the Shea Moisture Hanuka Honey and Yogurt Hydrate and Repair Protein Power Treatment um, for extremely dry brittle hair. It is sulfate free and color safe. So um, it's basically like a deep conditioning hair mask. Um, and so I thought I would try this out because we all know that my hair has been super, super dry lately especially these winter months so um yeah so that's the fun stuff that i got at the grocery store i also just wanted to share my like salad meal preps i have five right here and then i have this one that i'm about to eat so basically all of these just have like half of an egg and then and they have a ton of veggies and then right before i eat the salad i've been adding some croutons some bacon bits and then on this salad in particular i also added that everything bagel seasoning just to see if it would do anything and then i'm going to eat this one with some chipotle ranch dressing that's my like favorite dressing so that's what it looks like i have some romaine lettuce some avocado carrots there's some cucumbers in there you can't really see them but there's cucumbers in there tomatoes half an egg and then the croutons and bacon bits. I was also gonna put, I got like chickpeas with the purpose of putting them on salads because I love chickpeas. Um, but after I put all the veggies on top, I was like, that's kind of a lot of toppings. Um, and I don't wanna like overdo it. I feel like you need to have like a certain topping to leafy greens ratio on salads. And I feel like this is a, I mean, this is actually kind of a lot, but most of these toppings are veggies. But yeah, I just wanted to show you my little meal prep. So I wanted to show you this. I got it at Target. It's the Birthday Cake International Delight Coffee Creamer. It's just a coincidence that I got it like right before my birthday. Um, but it honestly just tastes like vanilla. I saw the packaging. I was like, wow, that's cute. That sounds really good. 
but it just tastes like vanilla. And then I wanted to show you one more thing. Okay, the lighting over here is not good, but I got this off of Amazon. I've been like seeing these on Pinterest for years and I've always wanted to make one. I always thought it would be kind of a pain in the butt to make. And then I saw they have them on Amazon, like already made for you. So it's happy birthdays and then all of the months of the year. And then you can put all of your family and friends birthdays on little hearts and then on the back of the hearts so i put like their names then on the back i put like everybody's hold on baby everybody's like day so that way i always remember their birthday and i just love it so again kind of a coincidence that um, i'm showing you um right before my birthday that i got this but i just got it recently i'm so in love with it i don't have any family or like close close friends with january birthdays isn't that weird so so yeah. Today is my birthday. Um, this weekend we went to Portland and like that's we like pretty much already celebrated my birthday. Um, I made a cake that like number cake um, I was telling you guys about earlier, which I included a couple of clips. And then we all went to Spaghetti Factory, like with all my family down there, and it was a lot of fun. Um, and today I don't really have any plans right now. I'm going to Starbucks and Walmart, and I'm going to get my free birthday drink from Starbucks, I'll pick up some frozen pizza, and we're gonna do frozen pizza tonight. Um, I actually already got like my favorite frozen pizza from Target, um, but I'm just gonna get some like frozen cheese pizza for the kids, and then like a bunch of other stuff, just regular groceries for the week. Um, this weekend, actually, my hair caught on fire when I was blowing out um, my birthday candles so that was fun I'll include like a, a close-up picture of that it was only like a tiny bit honestly like you can't I can't even find the piece that burnt off that was scary for like a couple seconds that was scary I thought all my hair was gonna burn off um, but luckily like barely any did and you can't even tell where um, it burnt off so and then at the spaghetti factory they had the staff sing me happy birthday and I don't think I've ever done that before I don't think I've ever like um, had a restaurant sing me happy birthday so that was embarrassing um, but it was it was fun so I'm like so tired I'm gonna get this coffee um, I'm gonna film my like what I got for my birthday I've filmed that like every year since I've been on birthday um, on, oh my goodness, on YouTube so I don't know if I'm going to film it today or tomorrow. Um, I think like maybe after I get like a nap or something later today, I might like be more in the mood to like actually like sit down and put on makeup and film. But, like right now, I just like want to get a coffee and then I want to take a power nap. <laughs> I don't really know what else we're doing today. Oh, I also got like some like little dessert goodies. The baby's waking up. Um, at Walmart grocery pickups. I'll show you those when we get home as well. Good morning, welcome to Starbucks. 
much. Where can we get going for you? Hi, can I please get a venti cocoa cloud macchiato? You said cocoa cloud, right? Yes. And did you want that iced or hot, my friend? Hot, please. All right. Anything else? Breakfast, maybe? Nope, that's it. All right, we'll see you up here for $5.99. Thank you so much. All right, thank you. Hello. Hello. $5.99 this morning. Can I use my um, birthday drink? So sunny outside and I'm not used to it because usually like during winter well I mean like every winter it's always like super dark in the morning in Seattle and it seriously stays dark it's like 8 30 a.m. and even longer if it's like a, a cloudy rainy day I was actually kind of hoping it would snow for my birthday um, cause it's done that in the past. We've had snow days on my birthday, but not this year. The weather's been like kind of warm lately. Okay. So as always, here's the fun stuff that I picked up from Walmart. I got a few new things. First off, I got this Equate Blonde and Silver Purple Shampoo. This is the exact same as the Shimmering Lights. It says compare to Shimmering Lights. Um, I've been using it. It's the exact, exact, exact same. So definitely buying this. It's a lot cheaper. I got this. This was in the freezer section. Macaroons, which if you don't know, macaroons are my favorite like dessert ever. That's why we had them on top of my cake this weekend. But the ones on top of the cake I got from like a local bakery. And these ones are just like from Walmart. They're in the freezer section. I don't know how good they're going to be. We got some, I don't know, maybe, maybe two years ago, I got some um, freezer section macaroons from Costco and I was the only one that liked them. I thought they didn't taste like macaroons though. They tasted like ice cream sandwiches. Nobody else liked them, but these have chocolate, vanilla, raspberry, pistachio, lemon, and coffee. And they also like this one. I don't know if you can tell they're already breaking. So they look like fragile, like real macaroons would be. So we'll see. And then I got this Ben and Jerry's Cookies and Cream Cheesecake Core. So yummy. I mean, well, I don't know if it's yummy. It sounds so yummy. I love cheesecake. So gonna also try this. I don't know if like we're gonna try it tonight or whenever, but I got it. Little treats to myself since it's my birthday. Coconut Berry Red Bull. Um, I vlogged myself like trying this for the first time a few weeks ago. And this is like the third or fourth time I've gotten it since then. It's so good. And then this is something new that I just saw on the Walmart grocery app. All of this stuff, by the way, um, I ordered on the app. Um, but it's Great Value Cookie Butter. And I didn't know Great Value had cookie butter, so I got this. I don't think the kids have ever, ever had cookie butter. They love Nutella, though, so I wonder if they'll like this. Um, so I'm going to try this one out. Great Value. And then this is, like, going to be my little birthday lunch creamy lobster bisque again this was another like treat yourself sort of thing since it's my birthday and then this i've never seen either um and it was just in my like recommended original bitchin sauce it's an almond dip but it says it's oh it says bitchin and saucy i thought it said bitchin and spicy so i was like that's interesting um dip spread or smother on your favorite savory food it looks like this so I thought we'd try that. They also had this, in, and this is the original flavor, and they also had another flavor. But we're going to try the original first, see if it's any good. Don't know what we're going to eat with it, though. Like, if we're going to have it with chips, or maybe I'll try, like, cooking something with it. Like, put it on chicken or something. I don't know. But it was honestly just kind of one of those things where I was like, it, where I saw it in the app. And, that, like, if you've been around, I love trying new food. Like, I just love trying new food. So we're trying it out. So that's the fun stuff oh and i got pizzas i think i'll show you those tonight um but i got two pizzas from target a couple days ago when i was there and then um i just got like a plain great value cheese pizza um at walmart the great value pizzas by the way are so good they literally taste the same as DiGiorno if you like DiGiorno okay so here's the cheese pizza it's great value we're making it first because are you really a mom if you don't cook your kids dinner first on your own birthday all right kids pizza is done and now time for 
the grown-up pizzas. Now these ones are from Target. This is the spinach and goat cheese from Archer Farms. This is my favorite pizza in the whole wide world. It's so delicious. And then I also picked up this one. It is mushroom and truffle oil. I've never tried it, but I love mushrooms. Hair and makeup. I've done them since I last vlogged. I filmed it, so that video is up already. But I switched out of my dress and into some like comfy clothes. Um, since all we're doing there tonight is just picking out. So, but I just feel so glamorous. Just did this literally just for like the video. But um, yeah. guys I just realized that if I film on this side of my kitchen the lighting is better this whole time I usually film on that side of the kitchen but um, so yesterday on my birthday I filmed my what I got for my birthday but today I just got this from my sister um, she sent it through Amazon it's earth and sea spa essentials so I thought I would unbox it it's in, like this cute little box um, this smells like this my, we used to go when i was a kid we used to go to like this little beach shop on our vacations um and it literally smells exactly like that beach shop and that shop has since closed down but it looks i don't want to break it because there's like some that plastic look how cute so i'm going to take everything out like one by one and show you what it comes with but it comes with a candle earth and sea aromatherapy candle the essence of nature for home and spa Ooh, has kind of like a little um like nutty scent to it. it says it has 11 natural oils including jasmine lotus amber and moroccan rose um and it awakens sensuality while relaxing mind body and soul cute put it back in here I don't even want to like use these things because they're just so pretty in this box and then it comes with a little towel and a uh I, I've always called these loofahs apparently that's not technically a loofah though but a little loofah a little hummus stone um and then it comes with one of these like massagers love that um some bath salts earth and sea this one doesn't have anything on it but we're gonna smell them Ooh, that smells really good there's definitely lavender in there which isn't my favorite but it's mixed with other stuff i just can't tell with what it's mixed with and then we have a little bar of soap my soap dish wrapped so nice Ooh. That's like the same scent as the bath salts, I think. So, so cute. I don't even want to use these things. I just want to like put it on display how it came. Like, again, don't want these things to fall out. Like just like that, I just want to put it in my bathroom like that because it's so, so pretty. Ah, so thank you to my sister Kaylee. Um, I'm obsessed, I can't wait to use these. I will use them, just, it's just too cute in this box. I'm keeping this box. Um, so yeah, so there's that, and then I also wanted to show you, um, I got the kids, uh, 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 St. Patty's Day shirts, so the Children's Place, which I didn't know this until recently, um, has free shipping all the time, no minimum order, and so I literally spent $15, um, and got free shipping, because they have it all the time, so, um, I just got three shirts, they're about $5 each. And let me show you. But they're matching shirts for St. Patty's Day and they're all just green shirts that say Irish. So this is in a little boy's medium for my son. And then for my daughter, this is in, I actually got hers in a little boy's and the toddler boy's cause she likes the fit of boy shirts more than girl t-shirts you know girl t-shirts are kind of like slimmer and the t sleeves are like tight against your skin and she prefers like the baggy um fit of like a boy's shirt so i got her the boys um toddler and irish but if you have a girl who prefers like the girl fit they have the same 
same shirt with a girl fit um so there's that and then for the baby i got this in three to six months so all the same shirt all for them to match on saint patty's day and they were all on sale too um they were all on sale for about five dollars each and they're all 9.95 originally so about half off plus free shipping um that's a steal you know so um, I ordered those and I'm definitely going to be ordering from Children's Place and Gymboree too. I didn't know the two were like connected, but um, I'm assuming if uh, Children's Place has free shipping all the time, no minimum, Gymboree probably does too. But I never knew that, so I'm definitely going to be purchasing the kids' clothes from Children's Place for now on. Um, especially like if they just need like one shirt or something um buying from children's place is oftentimes cheaper than getting them stuff on amazon because kids clothes can get pretty expensive on amazon um actually there's even times when like i've seen a shirt at walmart for like five bucks and then i go on amazon and i'll see the same shirt for two to three times as much for like 10 to 15 bucks for the exact same shirt that's at walmart and i don't know if it's like people reselling stuff they get at walmart or like what's going on um but it's happened before so i'm gonna put these up until saint patty's day because like i said it's like three weeks away and i actually got the baby oh she's waking up um i got the big kids their shirts and their actual sizes but i got the babies in the size up because right now she's zero to three months i got it in three to six months since um it's still three weeks away. So that's all I wanted to show you for now. Um, see you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so it is Friday and I think I'm just gonna end the vlog here. We don't really have much going on this weekend. I just uh, toned my hair with like purple shampoo. Something that I've been doing is um, I've been putting the purple shampoo on my hair while my hair is dry and then I leave it on for like 20 minutes and then I get in the shower and wash it all out and it's been working so much better when I do it that way. I actually got that idea from TikTok, um, which I don't know, maybe that's how like normal people use purple shampoo. I've always just used it in the shower while my hair was wet and I put it on wet hair, left it on for a few minutes and then washed it out. But this way has been so much better and it hasn't been turning my hair purple like purple um conditioner does so um i just wanted to let you guys know that little tip but uh yeah i'm like i'm so in love with this color right now when it's like toned like this so but i think that's gonna be it for this week's vlog i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you in the next one bye guys